Due to high demand for certificates, certificate authority could easily become bottleneck of entire system. And in order to solve this problem, two additional layers are created. So of course at the top we have certificate authority. And first layer beneath it, it's intermediate certification authority. And these organizations usually have a role of issuing certificates. Then third layer, it's registration authority. Organizations on this layer are dealing with data validation. And now, in order to make all of this publicly available, we have certificate repository. And of all data about certificates that we need, actually the most important is certification revocation status. In better words, we want to know whether certificate is still valid or not. And there are actually two ways to check for that information by certificate revocation list or with online certificate status protocol. Certificate revocation list is usually located on local system and OCSP on publicly accessible server. 